friends in this video we are going to talk about the basic anatomy this video is all about the anatomical terms and positions which is commonly used by the medical professionals such as doctors nurses we used to study these terms and positions when we are medical students so let's begin this Hello, Namaste, Ola Priviyat viewers. Welcome to my channel, Med Gossip SD. I am Subhas. The main objective of this channel is we bring basic medical and clinical science topics, explanation with the related diagrams, much as possible, and frequently asked exam-oriented questions of that related topic. So make sure you hit that red button of subscription and the bell icon so that you could never miss the updates. So, in the first diagram, it refers as when a person is standing straight, eyes and face looking forward, both arms by the side of the body with palms facing forward and feet together. They are commonly known as anatomical position. This position is important in anatomy because it is a position of reference for anatomical nomenclature. In next diagram, it refers as when a person is lying on his or her back, arms by the side of the body and palms facing forward and also fit together. It is commonly known as supine position. The next diagram is when a person is lying on his or her face, chest and abdomen, it is known as prone position. The next diagram shows when a person lying on his or her back with legs up and feet supported in straps, it is said to be lithotomy position. This position is commonly used while delivering of the babies. Now moving forward. To the terminologies related to movements. The first one is circumduction. The circumduction term refer as when a person is moving his or her body in a circular manner it is known as circumduction. We can see in diagram it is rotating in a circular manner. The next terminologies are flexion and extension. Here in the diagram we can see the upper part and lower part of the body has been flexed and extend. The flexion refer as the bending and decreasing the joint angle whereas the extension refers as straightening or increasing the joint angle. Moving towards next terminology they are pronation and supination. We can see in the diagram the palm anterior refers as supination and the palm posterior is pronation. That means pronation refers turning downwards and supination refers turning upwards. The next terminologies we have abduction and adduction. So here the diagram is showing in abduction the person is moving his hand away from the midline and in the adduction a person is moving his hand towards the midline. So we can see the midline is the given arrow part. Next we have in the terminology, it is eversion and inversion. So that 
in the eversion and inversion the body moving or turning outward refers as eversion and the body turning inward is inversion thank you for making me a part of a day i'll see you in the next video like the video if you did subscribe to my channel if you aren't already stay tuned for the next video in medgosibasti bye bye